Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as I posted earlier this year, back in June, Microsoft relaunched the Insider Beta Channel program for Windows 10 users uh, to test a couple of new features trickling over um, from Windows 11, as I've been mentioning in a couple of videos. Now it seems that a couple of months later, five months to be exact, that um, Microsoft has now announced that it's once again shutting down the beta channel for Windows 10. And this is actually not the first time this has happened. Um, back in 2022, um, as you may well know, Microsoft closed down the beta channel of Windows 10 um, in favor of Windows 11 preview testing because obviously Windows 11 became the main focus. And with less than a year to go um, before the official end of support according to Microsoft of Windows 10 on the 14th of October 2025, Microsoft once again is closing down the beta channel. And when the beta channel did launch five months ago again, relaunch, um, there was a bit of excitement because it was, okay, Microsoft is starting to push a couple of new features, um, which could, could have indicated that they weren't actually going to end support next year in October. But I think um, with the closure of the beta channel, I would say this is a so-called nail in the coffin of Windows 10. And uh, Microsoft has, though, given us the the um, option as a home user, if you want to carry on receiving updates and quality updates and security updates after the end of support in October next year, then you can pay 30 US dollars for one year, 12 months of support, which I will do for the purpose of this channel. But uh, um, in a blog post, Microsoft has officially said, and I'm going to quote this, and this is actually from the blog post of the update um, that's currently in preview for the beta and release preview channel inside. It's KB5046714, which I posted on earlier today, and I'll leave that video linked down below and in the end screen. And I'll also leave the video I posted on extended support for $30 down below and in the end screen. But Microsoft has said in the change log for this next optional bug fix C release update, they say this will be the last time we release a Windows 10 build to the beta channel as we will be shutting down the beta channel for Windows 10. They carry on to say insiders on Windows 10 in the beta channel will be moved over to the release preview channel and we will continue to release builds for Windows 10 in the release preview channel only going forward. And they also mention that insiders on Windows 10 today in the beta channel can also move to the release preview channel on their own via settings. And obviously, you can head into settings to get that all done. So that's Microsoft's official stance on why they am um, on the closure, sorry, of the beta channel. Now, um, basically, in a nutshell, what Microsoft is saying is that it will still flight builds of Windows 10 in the release preview channel. But at this stage, though, we don't know if Microsoft still, still intends to roll out new features for Windows 10 users. As I always say with Microsoft, only time will tell. So obviously, if and when that happens, I'll keep you guys in the loop. But I think this is a good indication now that Microsoft is starting to um, slow down a little bit when it comes to Windows 10 when it comes to new features, because as mentioned, the end of its support is drawing closer, less than a year. And I think the closure now of the beta channel could suggest that um, this is indeed so. But as I mentioned with Microsoft, only time will tell. And at the, un at the end of the day, only Microsoft knows what they will actually do with Windows 10. But uh, just keeping you guys posted, beta channel is no more. And wanted to keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.